Is film photography dead or are these just collection items? Now besides the Nikon F4 over the past couple weeks, the other popular topic going around on YouTube and in the industry is film photography dead? Is it a fad? Is it over? Is it something that no one should really worry about? Now a lot of people who are saying this tend to be a little bit older, but I don't know if they really understand the industry and they're a bit aggressive with their opinion, but there are a ton of people, if you want to call people hipsters or the younger crowd that are really getting into a lot of film photography now. And it's great that um, old film is now coming back. There's resurrection of film. There's something that's going to be coming out. I don't know if it's on pre-order, but more film will be available soon. So you're actually getting a re-emergence of film. And I absolutely do not think film photography is dead. Now, I used to shoot film photography a little bit. I don't want to say a ton. I was more digital, but I got lucky and I had a few friends who uh, had access to a dark room at their school. So I was able to use that a little bit and do some manual prints. But you really have to distinguish what do you mean by film photography? You're talking about it all? Or are you talking about mainly like roll film, pack film? Or do you want to talk about something more instant? Now, if you never saw one of these, this is the Polaroid SX70, which uses, um, you know, SX70 film, Polaroid, uh, Impossible Project makes it. And uh, this is what goes to my point is saying that instant photography, I think, is at an all-time high between Instax film, Impossible Project film. Um, you're seeing a lot of people go out and buy this type of stuff, even though the film is severely overpriced. And that is very disappointing. But it's even coming to the point where people are going out and getting, like I got a Polaroid 600 SE because it's a different form of shooting than just taking out your digital camera and doing something. You're able to take something different, you know, load some film into it and have some fun than to just do the same mundane stuff. So I don't think it's fair to say film photography is dead with the emergence of film coming back and people still trying expired film. I think it's rejuvenating now in 2017. And I, I think the common argument is that People aren't buying film cameras, they aren't refurbishing cameras anymore, um, and people are just too lazy to shoot film. Now, the only agreement I, I have with that is that it's not necessarily laziness, it's just the inconvenience because not a lot of people have access to dark rooms, not a lot of people have access to print their own stuff, and now to even find options to send away and everything is absolutely difficult. Like, you used to be able to go to like your local drugstore, like a CVS if you're in the States, and you could drop it off and they could do something. Now, I think there are still some of these places that have options, but it could take seven to 10 weeks just to process, even if you get like the instant film ones. So is film photography dead? No, like I said, I even think it's a, a re-emergence and a rejuvenation of the art. I just think it's very hard to do because of the inconveniency of getting film processed and everything. And, 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 and it is a learning feature, you know, I'm not here to, you know, teach you about film and taking street notes and everything like that, but it's not dead. It's a rejuvenation. What do you let, what do you think? Let me know down in the comments below. Uh, if you shoot film, what do you shoot? What kind of film do you shoot? Do you do Polaroids? Do you like regular uh, 35 millimeter or do you do medium, medium format? Uh, and how do you get a process? What do you do to get your film processed? I know there's a couple like little indie labs and pop-up shops around certain cities, but let me know down in the comments. Is film photography dead? I think not. Open your eyes a bit more just to see how it is.